I have read about this event for a bunch of years in a magazine that I get at home and I've always wanted to come and I had the opportunity to come tonight and I'm really excited to check it out and hopefully run into some of my friends. I had heard that there were 700 people coming to the event tonight and I thought I'll come a little early and just get a feel for it. I show up and there's hundreds of women waiting outside and it was such a great feeling as a female to be surrounded by women of all different ages and all different types, just that female connection, it was really great. And it was decorated and everybody was so happy and all the volunteers and very welcoming. And I was excited just to see all the booths and also maybe learn a little bit about health and um, just really get to know the hospitals and some of the doctors and things here. So I was really excited about it. I think events like this just reinforce, you know, health and for me as I age, just wanting to go into that part of my life the best possible and just reinforcing, you know, diet and wellness and, and mind and body, just making sure that I'm in a good place. That bus was incredible. It was like a doctor's office in there and there's actually a doctor that I could talk to about the fact that my parents have had replacement surgery and the fact that I'm having a little bit of pain in my knee when I run. It was amazing. It was like a free consultation. I just bought three pairs of earrings here. I got to meet the artist. She designed them all herself. They were absolutely beautiful. I paid barely anything for them, and they're wonderful. And I can wear them with a lot of stuff. To meet the designer, she's fantastic. She's here talking to you about the product and what would look good on you, and she has so much skill. It was just unbelievable. I felt like I was at a craft show. Okay, so I just saw one of those dogs that make you feel better at the hospital, a working dog, and he had the hair extensions on his tail. And then the lady that was with him, his caretaker, she had the same pink in her hair. So tonight we're doing bone density scans of the heel. They're good for women to have. It uh, assesses them for osteoporosis. It is a benefit. So every woman should have one done, especially when they're free. The bone density scan was pretty neat. And what it did was it established a baseline for me. So as I kind of go through life, I know that I'm on track and everything looks good right now. So as I go into you know maturing and aging, I'll kind of know where I stand. So that was pretty cool. I was asked to sign up for a mammogram, which was great because it's always good to have a reminder to do the things that maybe you don't look forward to doing. But I just had one, so I didn't have to do that, so that was good. And then I came in this other area and they were doing health and heart screening and I could get my blood pressure tested and I could um, maybe fill out a questionnaire for my parents. My dad's had open heart surgery and things like that, so it was a little bit on my mind. So in addition to all the amazing healthcare, there's also some really fun booths. I just stopped by a booth um, and what they did is they took a picture of my skin and they did a perfect match for foundation and they wrote it down and then I can go into a Sephora and get a sample that will be a perfect match. And for me, every time I go to the store, I don't know, am I light, am I fair, I don't even know. And now I feel like I can have a perfect match for my foundation and it was really fun. I 
came and I signed up for the vein screening. Vein problems are pretty common in our community and as you can see there are a lot of uh, uh, people lining up and I'm not sure if we can accommodate everybody but um, it is a little bit beyond just a spider vein or a varicose vein. In fact, this is a medical condition that can cause significant disability in terms of swelling, tenderness, pain, um, and other conditions. And ultimately, if not treated, can cause uh, significant problems such as uh, ulceration and soreness in the legs um, that don't heal easily. Um, the good news is that we have both good screening tools and treatments for it. I can't be seen today because the doctor had a real emergency. But we are at a hospital, and these are real doctors, and these are real screenings that you can participate in. It's amazing. So I'm not disappointed at all. They took my information. I can come back to the office if I choose to. But the fact that a real doctor was going to see me who got called on an emergency, see, that's what this is all about. The band was amazing. I've been listening to him play all night, and the ladies dancing were fantastic, but not me dancing. I got out there and tried, and it didn't go so well. But they have great moves, and it was great to see them out there having fun. I had an amazing time. I'm so glad I came. Like I said, I read about it for years in their brochures that they mailed to my house, and I always was intrigued by it. I came, I came by myself, hoping to meet up with my friends, which I did, and it was an amazing combination of health and fun. It was decorated beautifully, they had great food, they had chocolate, they had wine, just a collection of women everywhere. Um, it was about health and wellness, and you could actually feel such a positive spirit here. It was just amazing, and I'm so glad I came. I learned a lot, got to ask a lot of questions, got to meet people that are probably gonna become my um, care providers, and um, it was just a great experience. It was awesome.